today is 6.13. Um, just leaving the, I think, Rattle Ridge Hostel. Um, and it is like around 9 a.m., probably like two or three miles in. Um, we're finishing up New Hampshire. We're either doing like a 12 mile day to a, uh, a shelter just before Maine, or we could do a like seven, 16 or 17 mile day right after the main border. So it's about over 6,000 feet of elevation gain if we do the longer day to Maine. Uh, so it's definitely a lot of work. And we started probably around like a little bit after eight or so. So a little bit of a later start. We'll see, we'll see how we feel. We'll probably get to the first shelter and assess the situation, uh, if we could push on or not. But other than that, we'll be getting to Maine probably by tomorrow or today depending on how we feel. The, um, the hostel was really nice. Um, a lot of hikers stayed there. It's not just hikers at the hostel, it's all sorts of you know people there, but it's pretty packed. It was a lot of fun. Um, they had a nice like family dinner there with a, a cook and uh, everyone there was really nice. So if you're coming in this area, I would recommend it staying there um and yeah i think that's it for now all right so we're by the stream just uh filling up some water hydrating our dinners what do we got today we got couscous today couscous today and I'll just hydrate and see. So just hydrating the ramen. Uh, basically, we're like three miles or so from the shelter and crossing the main border. So that'll be enough time for the ramen to hydrate. And uh, Nick caught a friend. So he's just there enjoying the uh, whatever's in here. Maybe if he keeps it on his bag and a fly tries to fly, it'll make him lighter. So. I've about a thousand of these types of videos, and they're all about pretty much the same to most people, but. All right, so we're basically at the top of uh, Mount Success. We successfully climbed Mount Success. And uh, it's our last mountain of uh, New Hampshire, bittersweet. But uh, we're going to be heading uh, past the main uh, border after we get down from this. So finally made it. Conquered the whites and... Uh, now we have the longest state um, yet, to about 283 miles, I believe. And uh, it has its own challenges in itself. And everyone says it's just as hard as New Hampshire. So we shall see. Uh, but yeah, it's pretty iconic. Um, the whites and the presidentials and definitely something I'll never forget. <laughs> Climb this with Evan's phone so I don't break mine.
in me. Now we're in me. Todd in 282. second day in Maine and um, we stayed at the Carlo Carlo Cole shelter I believe something like that last night um, we're about I don't know about a mic mile away or so from Grafton Notch I believe uh, I'm sorry Mahusik Notch and uh, it, people say it's the hardest or funnest mile in the AT so just like a bunch of boulders and down trees and whatnot it's like a big adult jungle gym type thing but uh almost there and then a big uphill climb with the mahusik arm and uh i think that'll be the toughest part of our day and uh should be around like a 10 to 16 mile day depending on how we feel and yeah that's about it that's the plan for today It's not bad. Oh, that's <laughs> wow, it's, it's really rocky. You see that? Yeah. That's what it is. Like, and now I can't really see. I guess it's keeping it going. Okay. Woo. It's really cold though. It's not very refreshing. <laughs> It's just, it's just really cold. <laughs> I'm sure it feels good on your joints. <laughs> <laughs> 